If you're watching at home tonight with Fido and all he knows how to do is sit and fetch, well, you might want to shield those puppy dog eyes. We're about to bring you to a canine surf competition where animal athletes put the rest of us to shame. Your eyes are playing tricks on you. Surfing's gone to the dogs. What's not to love about a dog surfing? What's not to love about dogs and being at the beach? In Huntington Beach, California, canine competitors catch waves, shred, and wipe out in the annual Surf City Surf Dog Competition. All the way to the beach. Water-loving Westie Joey caught wave after wave. Joey's been surfing for about five years now. We were at a beach one day, and he helped himself to a stranger's surfboard, and we knew that was Joey's sport. This year, 64 dogs competed in seven categories, judged on style, confidence, and duration of ride. Famous surf dog Hanzo, the boxer, took first place in the extra large division. Proceeds go to animal charities, but bragging rights go to the top dogs of all sizes. You know, it's a really, really cool bonding experience being out in the water with her. I always felt like we got closer after we started this hobby. They're human-sized boards, just soft tops. Doggy surf lessons are available too. I found that it's a great tool to help build self-confidence and agility. After a while, it's not getting them into the water that's the problem, it's getting them to come back out because they're having so much fun. Hang 10, I mean, hang 20, pups. And you can learn much more about this ABC News digital short at abcnews.com.